Ladies and gentlemen, esteemed ABAP enthusiasts, gather around for a tale of wit, humor, and the magical world of ABAP development. Today, I invite you all to embark on a journey with me as we delve into the story of Zap, a funny and inspiring software engineer on a quest to become a certified ABAP cloud backend developer. So, without further ado, let's dive into this enchanting adventure and discover the wonders that await us in the realm of ABAP cloud development. Once upon a time, in the world of ABAP development, there was a witty and aspiring software engineer named Zap. With a knack of cracking jokes and coding, Zap set out on a quest to become a certified ABAP developer. Armed with some knowledge of programming languages like Java and Python and some other open source languages, Zap was ready to dive into the world of SAP and ABAP. Curiosity sparked and Zap ventured into the SAP learning site where a whole new universe of learning content awaited. Zap discovered the wonders of SAP business technology platform aka SAP BTP which is the magical foundation of the entire SAP ecosystem. Excitedly, Zap learned that the SAP BTP offered a unique solution for building cloud-ready applications and extending SAP systems. Eager to harness the power of ABAP, Zap uncovered the secrets of the new ABAP cloud development model and this enchanting model allowed ABAP developers to create cloud-ready business apps and extensions either side-by-side -side on SAP BTP or on the SAP S4 HANA stack. So on that note, Zap embarked on a learning journey starting with the beginner's path. With a twinkle in their eye, Zap set up their own ABAP environment on SAP BTP, feeling like a superhero with their very own ABAP studio. Here Zap learns how to set up its own ABAP environment on SAP BTP using a trial account and the SAP Business Application Studio and Integrated Development Environment for SAP BTP. Then further, he dwells into the basics of ABAP programming on SAP BTP, mastering object-oriented concepts, data types, control structures, and even writes his first ABAP program. And then he deepens the same with the ABAP development tools, ADT in Eclipse. Zap couldn't help but appreciate the syntax and structure of the ABAP, joking that it was easier than trying to untangle the headphone wires. But the adventure didn't stop there. Even Zap joined a live session on getting started with ABAP Cloud Development. Armed with pretty masks and curious questions, Zap made the session interactive and fun. They learned about the ABAP RESTful application programming model, RAP, four data services series, and SAP Fairy elements. Now Zap couldn't resist cracking a few jokes about coding in the clouds, making everyone laugh. But here's a twist and a catch. Here you need a SAP Learning Hub access to go ahead and register for this. And definitely, Zap had an SAP Learning Hub access so that he went ahead and registered for these live sessions. Now, with each step completed, Zap earned little badges as a record of achievement. He felt confident and motivated now. Zap decided to level up and tackle the intermediate learning journey wherein they acquired core ABAP skills. Exploring advanced features like ABAP dictionary, your internal tables, modularization, classes and interface, then inheritance and polymorphism, and exception handling. He also learns how to make use of ATC and the ABAP unit framework to ensure the quality of his code remains to the highest level standard. And Zap even enjoyed testing their code, finding and fixing bugs like a detective on a mission. So these are the overall agenda for this course that Zap went through. Next, Zap practiced clean co extensibility, wherein for SAP PDP, he learned how to create business services using RAP, define data models with series, and generate user interface with SAP Fiery elements. Zap's passion for creating user-friendly and elegant apps shone through as he solved real-world business problems with a touch of humor. Zap also learns how to extend SAP systems in a clean and consistent way using the ABAP Cloud development model and he also learns how to use the SAP Cloud SDK to consume SAP service and SAP build to design prototypes. So these are the details and overview of the content that he went through, all these various units that made him kind of an expert in trying to gain the clean core extensibility concepts for, with respect to becoming an ABAP Cloud developer. And then finally, Zap prepared for the certification exam, reviewing the exam topics and the objectives. With a confident smile, Zap took a sample exam to test his knowledge and then fearless and determined, Zap knew that he had the required skills and knowledge to conquer the exam and emerge victorious because he had gone through all the prior learning journeys with respect to the beginning of the path and then with the intermediate learning journey with respect to acquiring core ABAP skills and then practicing clean core concepts. And so, then finally, Zap registered for the certification exam and his heart filled with excitement and with a sprinkle of magic and dash of wit, Zap passed the exam with flying colors and he proudly received his certificate and digital badge and became ready to apply his newfound skills in real world projects. So, Zap's story is a testament to the power of learning and the joy of becoming an ABAP cloud developer. With a blend of humor, curiosity, and determination, Zap transformed into a certified backend cloud developer ready to weave spells of code and bringing cloud power dreams to life. So, my fellow ABAP enthusiasts, get ready to buckle up and join Zap on this exhilarating journey. Together, let's unlock the power of ABAP Cloud and become the rock stars of the coding world. And as we become the rock stars of the coding world, let's embark on our own magical quest to become an ABAP Cloud developer. So, lights, camera, ABAP. Let's make this Hollywood worthy adventure once again.